something of that in these continued um, accusations of anti-Semitism that keep uh, surfacing even now? I mean, in the history books and in the... No, I think that is mainly kept up by the Freudians ah. as a policy. Ah. Uh-huh. You see, the developments of time have made that Freudian, Freudianism has so much won out mm -hmm. in the world mm -hmm. and is taught at every university in every school and you have Freudians in every clinic nowadays and so on, that you can say uh, people are beginning to be a bit sick of it. I mean, it's become, it's become self-evident. Mm. I mean, there is a certain truth in, in, in what Freud has found, and that is now self-evident. Everybody knows that one can have repressed sex and, uh, and the Oedipus complex. That's now become common knowledge. So now the development goes to discover Jung, because he's still new to the masses, to the, to mm -hmm. the majority of intellectuals and so on. And the Freudians feel the losers. They feel they are becoming... They are begin to do Barbie people do not be mm -hmm. anymore on top, and so they keep up that uh, libel mm -hmm. quite artificially for mm -hmm. professional reasons. <laughs> you could even say, <laughs> <laughs> and then the and then there is another uh, aspect, namely fear. Mm -hmm. You see, there are many people who who are terrified of the unconscious. And as Jung is a kind of advertiser of relating to the unconscious, you have to find something to shout him down. Mm -hmm. It's, it's a, a defense a, against the a defense. unconscious. So it's not so much a defense against Jung, but a, really mm -hmm. if you analyze, if you look at those people who have those terrible resistances and always keep up that libel, if you, even if you prove to them, you show them all the facts, mm -hmm. and then emotionally they just go on. Mm -hmm. Yes, but mm -hmm. he was an anti-Semite somehow, anyhow. Mm -hmm. Then it's generally that. Mm -hmm. That they are afraid of their own unconscious. Mm -hmm. And uh, we can't find many things. Jung has lived in such a hidden life, you know. I mean, he, he has never gone into the world much or taken any attitude that they always dig up that old story that he was the president of the German society mm -hmm. and, and that that proves that he's anti-Semitic. Mm -hmm. So there isn't much in his life to go on. They have to search for something. They have to search for something. I see. Mm -hmm. 